Oh. Hey, what's up, guys? I hope you guys had a good, happy holidays, and I wish all of you have a fun and prosperous new year. We're in the year 2020, or is it 2020? I don't know. Whichever you prefer saying it. I hope you guys have fun, not just you and your loved ones, but pretty much, most importantly, everybody. So, Ice Cream Man. I was not aware about this existence. Yeah, I know, kind of sad to be honest. This is a trade paperback version, um, volume 2, as you already saw. And due to my room being dark, it's going to be glare, but I'm going to do the best I can to utilize. And here's a quick rundown from the back. There you go. Image comic, you know, definitely represent. And, and before I start, you already know, got to show pe give people their credit. You know what I mean? Remember, it's not just one person that made this happen. It's a group of people. And also, copyright information. Now, as I was saying, I received this as a gift, and I wasn't aware about this ice cream man. As a matter of fact, as you see, I only received volume two. But, <clears throat> with that being said... I highly recommend you guys going out and grabbing this. This is the best way to describe it is if you're a fan of Tales from the Crypt or shows like Are You Afraid of the Dark or Tales from the Dark Side, I can go on and on and on. Pretty much, it follows the same theme as that. Now, because this is a trade paperback version, it's multiple of stories that this person... As you see, green eyes, you're supposed to represent something, but this person sort of have an impact on certain individuals th throughout their everyday life. And some of these stories are short, some of them are very brief, but overall compilation, really, really good. It Each character, you can actually see their situation and their mentality, and the art style. I can see what you see in the cover is pretty much how it is throughout. And I like how colorful everything is. And especially like the way, you know, it's like, even though everything here is, theme is dark and messed up, it does it in such a bright way where it's like, you can be like, oh, okay, you don't have to squint or try to figure things out. Or, you know, try to be like, oh, okay, I wonder what this panel is really trying to convey. It's crisp, it's clear, the writing, straight to the point. And I don't want to say, like, straight to the point was like, here, some debauchery. No, 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 no. This has some thriller elements to it. And really good creative imagery of horror. And I liked it. I enjoyed it. Especially this Ice Cream Man's own story it doesn't really d go too much but you can sort of piece things together like a puzzle through each story but for the individual that he comes in contact with yeah it's like um what's the best way to put it you might have had a normal mundane life but the moment every man pretty much appears or has some form of contact with you Two things, you only have two options of what's going to happen. Option one, you survive, but you're fucked up. Option two, you die in a fucked up way. Yeah. But, overall, I love the creativity. And like I said, I wasn't aware about this. But now that I have this, I want to definitely get the other trade paperback. I'm not sure how many they have now. But I'll definitely look into it and put it in the description down below. So obviously you guys can check it out. But yeah, if you can, go to your closest comic book store or go to your online comic provider, whomever, and definitely pick this up. Believe it or not, this is actually um, a popular comic series from what I was informed. Because I actually, um, it, you know, the person that gave it to me was telling me about, you know, but she was hearing and how everybody at the location she went to to get this for me it was pretty much my sister she um they were telling her 
at all these things they're like oh is he into this he into that definitely get this and all I can say is yes 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 um again would I recommend you reading this at work uh I if you get I mean as you can see everybody you guys know I'm a fan of trade paperbacks because it's like a good uh, amalgamation where this one's five through eight so you pretty much got like about uh, five or four like stories. Some of the stories are short, maybe a little more, but I don't want to give too much away. All I can say is definitely get this. I don't have volume one, so I can't really give too much of a origin or a backstory. But I will say this: so far, I, and this is volume two, and this is my first introduction. I want to collect them all. <laughs> And I highly recommend you guys do the same. I mean, if you want to get an idea, just a little taste of how crazy this whole situation is, I'm going to have to do a quick look. See, I no, uh, went too far back. Uh, yeah. Give me one moment. Should have been, uh, here we go. All right. Guy's falling. There's a vulture eating somebody's head. A dead person. A lady's on a cell phone. She's sort of pissed because it's a meeting. The vulture got her, you know, pretty much aiming for her eye. And, yeah. Yeah. Now, if you're not a fan of that type of art style, and I will admit, I will admit, a little, a tiny small smidget of comedy kind of like a dark humor it's not cool it's it's messed up definitely but it's very enjoyable <laughs> all right then um highly recommend checking this out ice cream man definitely collect them all all right then later